Geneva Police Hunt Possible Paris Terror Suspects Geneva, Switzerland, is on high alert as police search for suspects who may be related to the terror attacks in Paris. Swiss national authorities gave Geneva authorities a description of suspects who could be in Geneva or the Geneva region. Investigations are being carried out in close collaboration with international and French police. We have gone from a vague threat to a precise threat, Emmanuel Loverso, head of communications at the Geneva Department of Security, told CNN. She would not comment on the nature of the threat. The statement added that the level of vigilance in the city has been raised and that more police have been put on the streets. Swiss state media reports that it is unclear whether the people being sought are directly linked to the Paris attacks. A spokesman at the United Nations complex in Geneva, Riel Leblanc, confirmed to CNN that UN security staff at entry points were armed with heavier equipment than normal Thursday. Security measures were increased because of advice from Swiss authorities, Leblanc said. He said no extra security staff has been added. The Geneva complex is the second largest UN center in the world, after the UN headquarters in New York City. Eight attackers were killed in the November 13 Paris attacks, and two suspects are believed to be at large. They are being sought across Europe. Salah Abdlam, 26, was driving toward the Belgian border hours after the attacks when police stopped and questioned him. Authorities have not said what role he may have played in the attacks. Mohamed Abrini, 30, now the subject of an international arrest warrant, drove a car that was found abandoned in a Paris neighborhood where one of the attacks occurred. Authorities said he had dropped off one of the bombers who attacked the Stade de France. Last month, terrorists armed with assault rifles and explosives targeted several locations across Paris, including busy restaurants a concert hall and the Stade de France, where a soccer game between France and Germany was being played. They killed 130 people and wounded hundreds. ISIS has claimed responsibility for the attacks.